<laughs> yeah, please. Why is this motherfucker back? Wait, he caught up with Gray? What? But wait, Gray never had a sweatshirt on? Huh? Wait, what? Gray turned evil? <laughs> Did he just get instantly motion sick? Oh my god. Oh no. Really, my guy? You're the one that always loses! Really, my guy? You got to the dark side. You're a failure! Dude, what's with the arrows? Oh, it's Lucy. Could you guys be any more annoying? Mind your own business. I'll deal with Okay. So keep your little mouth shut and Poor Natsu. <laughs> wow, that was a really dumb thing to do. Wow. He doesn't have any combat skills. That's all the info Gray has on the best. Wait, that isn't Gray. No, 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 that wasn't Gray at all. Why is he speaking like in the third person? Whoa! What? Me? You've got to be kidding. <laughs> you don't know you're not the real Lucy, so you might as well show us your true form. Oh, I'll show you. And I think you'll find him every bit as real as Jack Dimbo. <gasps> oh my god! They even jiggled! <laughs> so wobbly. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Like you oh, so much jelly. Whatever, doesn't matter. Listen up, Sagittarius. Take them out. Wait, what? Did I do that? Huh? Are you... My body is out of control. Huh? Hang in there, you're gonna be alright. Copy of you, which means your spirits are forced to follow my Really? Me, Lady Lucy and Sir, That's pretty interesting. Dude, you literally you all not so have to oh. All Natsu have to do is just blow up the little boat and get in the water. <laughs> what? How did she get the key? Dude, Lucy is so broken in the sense that she is so useless. Every person that she fights always controls her Celestials! Wait, now she can't even close it? No! That is bullshit! My pets? What? Oh, it was just the schmucks. Oh, she's a celestial. Interesting. <laughs> she's summoned Aquarius. The gate of the scorpion? What? What? What did I have a feeling? Whoa! Smooth! Oh my god. <laughs> This is stupid. Oh, she's Loki? Yeah, it's Loki. Your handsome prince has arrived. Yeah, it's ironic because Loki and Hibiki kind of look alike. The Ram? Oh my god! 
God, no fucking way! How did you end up with one of Karen's spirits? Simple. I'm the one who put her six feet under. And as they say, what? much of an opponent she tried to open two gates at once when she barely oh my god the fool practically handed her keys over to me it worked out well but i wish she would have holy shit angel took my love away from Ooh. me she was murdered by Ooh. one of her own celestial he's destroyed. falling into hatred it's true aries and i were once friends but now we have new celestial touche and we'll fight for the wizards we've made. Ooh. It's a matter of that's that's But Scorpio and Aquarius didn't fight each other. Oh come on. I, I hate these invisible rules. No. Open gate of the chisel. <laughs> the chisel? What? Do what you do what? what is that? Um Wait, she attacked both of them? What the fuck? Oh, she's having Taurus. The bad bull. Making Lucy cry was the worst <laughs> move of your life. Get ready for a rodeo of pain. Oh, boy. This is dumb. Damn. Lucy's getting her ass kicked. Yo, this dude's losing it. Huh? She deserves to be happy, but that won't happen until she's free. Oh, she's gonna create a revolution with her other celestials. <laughs> what do we say? Peace. Let her go. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Gemini's about to step on me. We're like, yo, no. Hurry up. I hear a strange voice. What? Oh. She Aww. She's willing to give up her life for us. Oh, you'll suffer Ooh. for that. Um, what is he gonna do? What the fuck? I'm gonna use Arca to teach you. Hyper? What? This is a one-shot deal, so make it count. Um, what? <laughs> so what happens to Hibiki now? Do he give her his power, or, or does he still have power? Is it more of a temporary thing? <laughs> what? Excuse me, Lucy! What are you doing? I don't understand what just happened, but it was badass. <laughs> Alright, that ending there was satisfying because I, I wasn't really enjoying the episode that much. Uh, there's just so many inconsistency here. When it comes to uh, the Oracion girl, what's her name again? Angel? So she has Aries, right? And... You know, we, we learn about Karen and how she abused Ares a long time ago during that little Lo uh, Loki arc. And I guess Loki and her have never met since then. But yet, in literally in the same fucking episode, you're telling me that Lucy, who has Aquarius, and Angel, who has Scorpio, are actually dating. So, if they're capable of communicating with each other... Why can't uh, Loki and Ares do the same? Mind you, we don't really know how the celestial world looks like or acts like. So, I'm a little bit confused as to how they haven't been able to see each other till now. I don't know, that just that seemed a little extremely far-fetched, but whatever. It was a really cool episode in the sense of, once again, having Lucy kind of stand on her own a little bit, but... Then again, she wasn't. It was kind of comedic to actually uh, disable a character like Natsu with his motion sickness so he doesn't have to save the day today. 
I was hoping Lucy could figure out a way to defeat this uh, chick uh, on her own, maybe with a kick, maybe with a punch, maybe, I, I don't know, through pure will, but it was through a MacGuffin, you know? It, it, it felt a little bit silly to see Hibiki kind of give her power, and Lucy did something, and yay. Lucy didn't really save the day on her own. Someone else kind of did. Now, maybe that's the whole point of it, because remember, this is sort of an alliance between all these guilds, so I guess in the essence of the storyline, it works. Uh, but as far as, like, the future goes, as far as Lucy goes, she's still not strong yet. I mean, again, she did say it a few episodes ago, like, why am I here? I'm, like, one of the weakest wizards out of everybody, so... I mean, it makes sense. I mean, I don't know why I'm complaining at the moment. It's not that I didn't like today's episode. I really did like it. It was extremely dramatic. It was extremely it was extremely action-packed. I'm just kind of like nitpicking little things that are, are a little bit annoying to me. But yet, when I hear myself kind of like voice it, it does kind of make sense. <laughs> so then I would say that it was a really great episode. <laughs> Fuck, I'm dumb! All right, so that's two down. Two of the oracion says are down. That means four to go. But then again, that weird face dude did turn over, right? He's a good guy now. So that that's three down, right? So I don't know. Man, this arc is definitely awesome, if not one of the best arcs so far. So I can't wait to keep going and seeing what happens next. Mind you, we still haven't got Jalar meeting Urza. They, we got that midnight guy wandering around. Then we still have that little midget dude from the blue uh, Pegasus who got kidnapped. I wonder what the hell that thing is going to be about. So there's still a lot of cool shenanigans to go. So, yeah. All right. So that about wraps up my video for today. What did you think? Did you like today's episode? Did you hate it? Discuss with me and others by leaving me any positive or negative feedback down in that comment section. Feel free to like this video or subscribe to my channel if you haven't before. And as always, God bless you. Thanks so much for watching. And farewell for now. Bye-bye.